Hey everyone, a little update I want to share today. Um, as some of you may be aware, I've been working on a book for the past uh, six years, though it feels like about 60. And that book uh, will be coming out March 28th. The book is titled Outlive the Science and Art of Longevity. And I'm here to show you today the cover of this book. The cover, which was designed by Rodrigo Correll and his team, uh, is the culmination of a lot of work. Uh, I would have never guessed it would be so hard to come up with a cover until we started actually working on one in August. This design did not get finalized until two weeks ago. Um, what else can I tell you? Well, I can tell you that this book is available for pre-orders. And um, that means that you can go anywhere that you would normally buy books and pre-order a copy of this. As I said, it'll be out March 28th. And one of the things that we were thinking about doing prior to this book coming out was doing a podcast where I'd kind of talk about the book and answer any questions that people have, you know, about the process and stuff. Because I, I have, a lot of people have asked me questions about this. And uh, if, if it's of interest, and, and again, I, I don't think we're committed to doing this. I think we'll see if people um, put some questions in this post. And if they do, then I think we'll definitely uh, be happy to, to, to record a podcast in the next couple of weeks to talk about that. Uh, and if not, let's just wait and see what questions people have when the book comes out. I will uh, be going on a number of podcasts, both you know just before and obviously after this book comes out. So um, there'll be lots to talk about. Um, what else can I tell you? Um, it's been a heck of a slog, truthfully. It's one of those things where I suppose it's like if a person runs a marathon and it's really, really hard. At the end of the marathon, they're really done. Uh, they're really glad that they, they did it, but they think to themselves, I'm really glad I didn't know how hard that was in advance. And I really feel that way. If six years ago you showed me a crystal ball and it said, this is what the next six years are gonna look like where nights and weekends, you're gonna be writing and rewriting and rewriting and writing and rewriting and tearing it apart and starting all over and blah, blah. I would have said, no thanks. Um, I'd rather get a root canal every day between now and then as opposed to doing that. But that said, you know, now that it's here and I'm really at the finish line with respect to this book, there are a couple little things that need to be done. Um, I, I can say I'm really glad I did it. Um, a lot has gone into this and all books on this topic are, of course, uh, going to be constantly subject to needing to be updated and the information, of course, will will some elements of it at least will, will become uh, dated over time. But the way, the way the book has really been written is is to be relevant a decade from now. And, and that was sort of my objective in writing this was how to, to, to shape this book in a way that if you pick this book up on March 28th, it's going to add value to your life. And if you don't read it till March 28th of 2033, I believe it's still going to add value because even though the science will have evolved, hopefully the way of thinking um, will still be relevant. So anyway, uh, I want to thank all of you for your questions, support, and all the things uh, that have gone into to, to making this uh, process sort of worth doing. Uh, and as I said, if you want to leave questions here in this uh, post, we'll, uh, we'll definitely be happy to put out a podcast in advance to answer any questions you have uh, as we wait to, uh, to get to March 28th.